and like risk their life, which is kind of rude. I, should, you, it's it's really heroic to risk your own life, but it's kind of fail to say, yeah, you guys need to come and risk your lives. <laughs> oh, the the Tower of Babel or whatever. Teleportation bias goes awry. Teleports demons into Tokyo. <laughs> Triggers a series of nuclear wars. Wow. So. <laughs> demons spawn in the world, and all of a sudden everyone starts attacking each other. That's kind of. Oh, well, no, I guess we kind of, I should have expected that. Humans are so pathetic. Oh, that's good. Well, as good as can come out of this current situation. Oh, really? Excuse me. Underground nuclear shelters. I see. Oh. Shinjuku Babel. Does that mean Tower of Babel? I'm I'm not very uh literate when it comes to what's it called? Um Japanese, so that may or may not say Shin Megami Tensai. What's this? Bright room. Huh? Oh, who are you? I suppose so. Snake man. Oh my god. <laughs> I did a double take there. I'm like, does that really say what I think you just said? Okay, so am I in like the overworld now with like other actual. No, I'm. S I assume that this is an online multiplayer game, the way that everyone was talking about it, but I'm starting to wonder. Sure, hear more.
30 ointments. Okay, I know where to go, I'm just... Have to capture a cute little fairy. Also, I'll say one thing, I'm not happy with the character customization so far. My character tends to just stare into the distance, kind of very... Very creepy looking. Um... As far as actual clothing design, I don't know, maybe the people who are fans of this game like having more realistic clothing and stuff, but me, when I'm playing an online RPG, I usually don't like to have my character running around in jeans and a t-shirt. It just kind of seems unprofessional. I know how to use a map. I have to say, I'm, I'm, I'd really like a different weapon than this. I just feel so out of place overall with my character being here. I'm probably going to end the video in just a couple seconds if I don't find anything that looks like it would be of interest to me at the moment. And then I'll say a couple closing words about my perspective on the game so far. Okay, I'm guessing that's an actual player, actually. Oh yeah, here's some actual players. Interesting. No, see, they all look kind of awesome. Or at least she did back there while I'm lagging just a little bit. Oh, look at this person. She looks more like... She's also using a sword. I mean, it's a more futuristic looking sword, but still. I don't know what the frick he's doing. Also, I don't know any of my guild members' names who play this game, so if like you guys watch this and I'm like accidentally making fun of your character, don't take it personally. Because <laughs> one, I don't know who you are, and two, it's just joking around. Like, for all I know, that guy is probably using some kind of super high-level skill that could probably one-hit me. So, shouldn't be cracking jokes about it, but still, look kind of funny. What are you, an experienced demon buster? Her clothes look extremely normal. That doesn't inspire me to confidence. Okay, he's got a gun. I'm happy now. That means we can get guns in this game. <laughs> I saw people using guns in the pic in the things, but I don't know. Okay, so this my two big questions was was this an actual MMO and if I could get something other than a melee weapon. And both were answered. So, that's good. Mission accomplished for right now. So yeah, I guess I'll see you guys later. Bye.